Hi everyone, Dominic here from Energy D, and I'm going to be talking about in this video why you should buy solar panels and solar equipment that are made in Europe and also I'm going to give you some suggestions for brands that I could recommend uh, to have a look at if you're thinking of going solar. So first of all, why buy made in Europe solar equipment? Uh, and especially now in a time where the majority of solar panels and, and equipment are not made in Europe, even though there is a bit of a bounce back in the European manufacturers going on right now. Well, the first reason is uh, the supply chain and the ma manufacturers and the ethics of where it's all coming from. So in Europe, um, compared to a global scale, uh, we're fortunate to have some of the best protections for workers and human rights. Um, and unfortunately, outside of Europe, um, then it takes an awful lot of due diligence uh, for any consumer product that you might buy. Uh, and this applies to solar uh, equipment as well. It takes a lot of due diligence to make sure that that isn't produced using forced labor or child labor or um, coerced labour, or even using labour from a concentration camp. Uh, and you can look at and do your investigations and your due diligence yourself if you're buying from outside of Europe, um, but that's extremely difficult. Um, and I think the recommended way is just to buy within Europe and then you have the protection of those European laws for the people who actually made those products. Um, the second thing is the actual quality that you're getting. Um, so some of the very, very best top manufacturers in the world are in Europe. Um, they're making the products that are most reliable, with the best features, uh, the newest technology that's going to last the longest length of time. It's as simple as that. So. You pay a little bit extra you get something a bit better or a lot better um, and oftentimes those premium companies and manufacturers are to be found right here in europe uh, second or third thing is uh, third reason why you should buy solar equipment made in europe is the guarantees and the replacements um, and the backup that you'll get by doing that um, so first of all, a lot of these companies, uh, the premium manufacturers who are located in Europe, are offering a lot of the very best guarantees with their products. But it's more than just what they say. Oh, anybody, you know, it's it's very easy, any manufacturer to say X, Y, Z years of guarantee. But it's when they're actually a European company, then they're bound by the strong consumer protection legislation in Europe. Um, and that's when those guarantees really actually count for a lot more than they would in some other cases. Uh, and the other thing with replacements, if you need a replacement part, it's going to be a whole lot easier and quicker to get that part if it's coming from Europe than if it's coming from the other side of the world. Um, fourth reason. If you're concerned about environmental impact, uh, the European manufacturers are really the obvious choice to go with. Um, they're bound by stricter laws on pollution and all that is controlled very well um, in Europe compared to many other parts of the world. They are um, using electricity for their generation that's generally lower carbon than a lot of other parts of the world. Um, and if you're buying from Europe, that means that the products are shipped to you over a much shorter distance. So again, there's less uh, pollution coming from the transport uh, when you buy from within Europe. So I hope I've convinced you, um, but the real key is to look at some of the specific brands um, that I would recommend to you. These are the brands that I would like to have in my own solar panel system and that I'd recommend you have in your own solar panel system as well. So the first one is Fronius. Uh, now these are an inverter manufacturer. And just in case you're not familiar with inverters, this is the part that takes the direct current electricity from the panel 
and it turns it into alternating current electricity that you can use in your house to power all your appliances. Um, now the inverter is kind of a smaller consideration and a smaller part of the system than the panels themselves. However, it's well worth being careful about the inverter brand that you go for. And the reason for that is while solar panels generally are trouble free for decades, um, even kind of um, middle of the range panels, the, um, the inverters are more prone to failure when you don't have a top quality model. So while your panels could be going for 20, 30 years, no issues, oftentimes an inverter can fail after five or 10 years. Uh, whereas if you go for Fronius, these inverters are just the most, they have the biggest reputation for reliability among any brand that I know of. Um, so you're just giving yourself a trouble-free um, uh, next couple of decades really for yourself by going with Fronius. And that's on top of the fact that they come with some of the best features and some of the highest efficiency. Um, so one really nice thing about them with, for example, their Primo models is that if you have a six kilowatt inverter, you can actually connect that up to nine kilowatts of panels, um, which is not something you can do with every inverter. And it's a really nice way to get around the ESB's restriction because they limit you to a six kilowatt inverter. But if you go for a six kilowatt Freudius inverter, you can also have nine kilowatts of panels. Um, and the second feature that they're known for more so is the production and consumption monitoring. So a lot of inverters um, from, from other companies will tell you, okay, you're producing X, Y, Z watts of electricity right now, or they'll even give you a graph of what, how much you produced over the last number of days or weeks or years. But with Freudius, they match that up with measuring how much electricity you're using in your house. And that means you can actually see, okay, um, last week I was making this electricity at this time and I was consuming so much and there was this amount going out to the grid. Uh, you can break the whole lot down and it's super easy. You just you see it on your mobile app and it's colorful and it's easy to use and it just works. Um, so overall, but I mean, the, the bottom, the most important thing is the, the, the reliability um, for your inverter and Freudius can't be beaten for that from what I know. So moving on to panels now, um, there are two companies that I'm gonna mention here. The first is Solitech. These are a Lithuanian company. They're manufactured in Lithuania, I mean, um, and they are offering a very nice range of panels. They're giving um, glass on glass options. They're giving all black options for aesthetics and they are offering good guarantee terms and the products are high efficiency. So they really have the whole package and if you're thinking of going for solar panels on your roof um, or not on or solar panels anywhere, uh, it's well worth having a look at Solitech and they're also coming in at a very reasonable price point. So they have the whole package. Second company to look at is Meyer Burger. These are the absolute most premium tier of solar panels going. So Meyer Burger, their history is not actually in manufacturing solar panels. Their history is in making the machines that are used to make solar panels. Um, but basically they got sick of everybody else ripping off their technology after they sold them one machine and then they would just go and make 10 of their own as copies. So they decided that, look, why are we delivering all the innovation and not getting the benefits from it? So going forward, they're not gonna sell their new technology to anybody. They're gonna keep it for themselves and they're gonna manufacture panels themselves. So um, they are currently just getting up and running with their first production line in Freiburg in Germany. And the panels are gonna be available to buy from July, 2021. So just next month, if you're watching this uh, shortly after it's made. Um, the panels, they're gonna come with the highest efficiency, 
the most robust um, construction, best guarantees. In fact, uh, they're going to be guaranteed for 92% of their original efficiency after 25 years and plus the 25 year warranty on the manufacturing uh, quality which is something you don't get it's, it's something you have to be very careful about with other brands a lot of the time they'll give you a 25 year power output guarantee but only an eight year manufacturer's guarantee but Meyerberger are given 25 and 25 um, and again they're giving nice all black aesthetic options and so on so if you're willing to pay for a little bit extra or, or a significant enough bit extra even in the case of Maya Burger, but you're going to get the very 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 best panels then those are the company to go for um, Maya Burger. So just a quick recap um, by buying in Europe you know you're getting something that is produced ethically without forced labour without concentration camps without uh, human rights abuses by governments and manufacturers you know that you're getting top quality products or, or at least there, there's very much opportunities to get top quality products um, guarantees and replacement parts are going to be just a lot, whole lot easier if if you do need those which hopefully you won't because they're robustly made um, and again if you're concerned about environmental impact then buying something that's manufactured nearby in a country with strong relatively strong environmental controls is the obvious choice and i hope i've persuaded you if i have the three brands to, to look out for now if you know of others please do let me know and put them in the comments but the three that i can recommend straight away are freudius for inverters made in austria solitech for solar panels made in lithuania and meyerberger for solar panels made in germany so thank you very much for watching and um, if you learned something from the video please give it a like and if you would like to get more updates on all sorts of topics to do with solar energy in Ireland then make sure to subscribe to the Energy D channel. Bye for now, thank you.